Uh, I, I know you're a very busy man, and we're just gonna we're just gonna touch on the uh, the actual organisation that you've built up here. And I think it's the first in Britain, anyway. It's it's a fantastic uh, event what you've what you've put on. It's unbelievable. Well, I came to the first one, to say. and it's it's sort of a, a nearly an, an American setup how you how you've actually set it up. So you must have gone there first think, and, and researched the. Uh, yeah, uh, uh, you, 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 you're right. We've spent many many years uh, in the British countryside covering fairs, and it's a very I, I want to. It's a very different concept to what we're looking yeah. for. And I said, I think we've all, I think we've moved on, and I think we need a shopping experience. Yeah. Once it sort of understood the concept, it then, uh, it's Stonely, it then started to gain momentum. Yeah. Then it was a leap of faith. Right. Now do we go to the next level? The NEC I, is a massive step. I, 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 absolutely. Massive step. Absolutely. You, you. Yeah. As soon as you mention the words NEC. Uh, the first thing is, oh. How much is that going to cost? Yeah, well, there you go. <laughs> exactly. Um, I said, it's proven in Europe, yeah. it's proven in America. I yeah. said, all we need to do is, is step up, step into it. I yeah. said, so. You've I, dragged us out of the field, I, <laughs> to be fair. You've dragged yeah. us out of the field into the into the manor house, and that's the difference. Yes. You know, the, 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 and it's smartening the mm. industry up altogether. And mm. you know, I think a lot of people out there will step back now and think he's done us he's done us proud here. Yeah, you, you must you've got to have a good team at back here to do all this. It's it's unbelievable what you've done here. In but, but, uh, yeah, when do you actually start planning, John? Honest truth, the British Shooting Show takes a team of 12 full-time staff a year. Bloody hell! Unbelievable that. And our ethos is, is you're on a journey with us and we're, mm. and we're trying to support you throughout the year. Yeah. All we want in return is to use to support us yeah. and engage with the visitor and give the visitor the experience. Yeah. And I think this year has seen a phenomenal growth and certainly from a visual perspective, yeah. Yeah. it's gone to another level. And it's, you're, you rightly said early on that uh, it's difficult to to explain to people outside of shooting mm. how good shooting is for the countryside. Yeah, it's an essential part of our countryside. Yeah. Um, w once on the inner circle, you understand it. If you're on the out, if you're on the outs outside of it, forgive me, but you'll never understand it. Yeah. And, it and it's easy for, for everybody to say no. Yeah. But to say yes, you've got to come on board. I like to see more youngsters encouraged into into the shooting world. We were studying um, the amount of children going through the air gun ranges. Yeah. And and from memory, we were averaging around about 800. Yeah. And we sat down and I said, this needs to change. This yeah. needs to change because this is the, this is our next generation of people. Yeah. So we then implemented the uh, 15s and under go free accompanied yeah. with their adults. Uh, and if they have two or three, four children with them, even better. Yeah. Um, our air gun attendants for the youngsters in year one went to 3,500. Brilliant that, absolutely fantastic. You've only got to look at the um, the type of uh, people that you've got here. You've actually got probably 90% of the, the best in the world at this show today, in, in, in the shooting industry. So I think you've, 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 you've achieved I think it's I said, a fantastic I, result for you this year. You I, think the, I think you know, the UK. Got, I think the UK is on the market. Yeah. Uh, you know, we're, we're on we're on the map now. Yeah. As we must be quietly smiling inside that it's, it's it does work so well. I mean, I I, I went out early on uh, nine o'clock and on the door, I, I had a word with Steve who, 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 who works for you, and I couldn't believe the the footfall. You know. We've, I thought this is double for what, from what it was last year. It was fantastic last year, but out there it's, I think it's the, absolutely even. I think one of the nice things is um, the amount of managing directors, CEOs that have flown in to the show this year. The level of interest that we have from the manufacturers does look as if we will now go into another two halls. So it will actually double in size for 2020. Beautiful. Um, that's what we want to see. That's what we'd love to. That's what you <laughs> want to see, and I want to see. Being in the industry myself. Well, I know you're a very, very busy man <laughs> and under pressure all the time. I've listened to your phone buzzing away there, and it's. I'm, 
I'm glad you found time to give us a bit uh, of an uh, interview. It's an absolute it's pleasure. And thank you very much indeed for your fantastic. time. Fantastic, lovely. And, thank, and thanks for what you do. It's uh, you know, well, at the end of the day, we all need to keep together. We're all on, we're all singing from the from the, <laughs> from the same hymn book. <laughs>